Did you know that Jose Limon and his family came to America in 1915 to escape the dangers of the Mexican Revolution? Limon studied art in Los Angeles before moving to New York and discovering a passion for dance. A new ballet film has made its way to the big screen. And no, this isn't black swan material. Ballet 422 is a documentary film chronicling the choreographic process of New York City Ballet, now soloist Justin Peck, as he stages the company's 422nd original work. Ever wondered what it takes to build a new ballet from the ground up? Now's your chance to get a sneak peek into the process. The Martha Graham Dance Company is celebrating the legacy of their traditional repertory in an inventive way. Lamentation Variations is a project that brings diverse variety of choreographers to create works inspired and adapted from Graham's original Lamentation. The project originated in 2007, and the works produced were so well received that it has become an ongoing project. This season, invited choreographers included Kyle Abraham, Liz Gehring, Sonia Taya, and Michelle Dorrance. The two-week run of performances at the Joyce kicked off on February 10th. It's already all over the web, but we liked it so much we had to feature it anyway. David LaChapelle's video version of Hosier's hit, Take Me to Church, is visually stunning. With choreography by Jade Hale Christofi, Sergei Palunin's performance is simply breathtaking in a set that feels heavenly and relaxing. The concept is refined, yet minimalistic and effective. I recommend you check it out if you haven't yet. Choreographer Wang Yi brings life and persona to an unexpected dance partner in his newest work, Wang Yi and Kuka. The piece features him dancing a duet with a German-made robot. He painstakingly coded every detail of the robot's movements for the work, with one minute of choreography requiring about 10 hours of programming. Oof, Wang Yi grew up in Taiwan, where he says he had a lonely childhood, and much like children create imaginary friends, he often longed for a robot companion. This piece brings that childhood fantasy to life, putting man and machine together on stage. The 10th anniversary of Celebrate Dance is making its return to the Alex Theater in Glendale, California next month on Saturday, March 7th. This anniversary production will highlight restagings of works from nine different companies, all which premiered in earlier years of the Celebrate Dance series. This is one you won't want to miss. Night Changes by One Direction is a feel-good contemplative song. The harmony adds layers and the lyrics question if you're living your dreams and taking chances on love and life. Does it ever drive you crazy? Just how fast the night changes. This song has a great message and can be used for class or maybe your next concept video. Remember that little pigtail girl from way back when who rocked it out in Missy Elliott's music videos? Well, she's all grown up, and Alison Stoner has definitely still got it. In a tribute video directed by Tim Milgram and jam-packed with a killer cast of dancers, she and her crew show that the old school tunes are still as hot as ever. Now the only question is, why wasn't Alison up there for the Super Bowl halftime show? 
Well, it's about that time. But before we go, get to know plugger Reginald Anthony Weber Jr., whose dance journey has literally taken him from coast to coast. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe so you're always on top of the latest dish. That's it for today. Keep smiling and dancing, and I'll see you next time.